Here is how you add a mini pop-up calendar in your Excel worksheet. And due to the numerous requests, we have updated the video to ensure that the calendar closes when the date is selected. The first thing you have to do is to introduce your mini pop-up calendar add-on here. Click on developer. If this developer is not available on your ribbon, right click anywhere on the ribbon, customize this ribbon. Make sure there's a check on your developer tab like this and click on OK. Once that's done, go ahead and click your developer. Under add-ins, click on add-ins here. Go to store. In here, you're going to search for something called calendar and press enter. And you'll be installing this one called mini calendar and date picker. Click on add and click on continue. And this is going to add a pop-up widget for you on your worksheet. After that, go ahead and close this menu by clicking on this cross here and just resize it nicely so that it looks something like that. Now, at this point, doesn't matter where you place your mini calendar, this will be repositioned as you select any of this cell here. After that, while selecting this guy here, go to home, editing, find and select under the context menu here, you're gonna select selection panel and then you're gonna give this mini calendar a name. I'm gonna call this calendar itself like this and press enter and close the selection panel. After that, press alternate F11 to launch your VBA editor and paste this VBA subroutine and constant here. One thing to note is that uh, this variable range cal identifies the location where this date will be allocated. Now I've identified as E5 to F18, which is E5 to F18, which means that if the user were to select any of this cell, a mini pop-up calendar will appear and you can select the date out of it. If you like a copy of this VBA subroutine, please leave a request on the comment section and I'll show you how you can get it. Go ahead and save it and close your VBA editor. Now, if you select anywhere on your worksheet, the mini pop-up calendar will disappear. Now, but if you select a cell in any of these two columns, you'll be allowed to enter the date and the mini pop-up calendar closes as you select the date. And as you select the date, the mini pop-up calendar will close.